and welcome. We are at Georgetown Grand Cayman Island. We just came back off uh, hell. Trip to hell. Our trip to hell. And back. And back. And now we're walking back up to the cruise port. Show you around. Just had a lovely drink here at the local beach bar. Let's see if we can pass through here. Yeah, we can. And of course, this is an island, so you can buy yourself fresh fish. And those fish aren't that far away. As you can see, they swim in the ocean here. And in the back, you can see there are three cruise ships in, on the island today. On the right, you see the Celebrity Equinox. In the middle, the Royal Caribbean Voyager of the Sea. That's our ship. And on the left, the Royal Caribbean Serenity, Serenity of the Sea. And look how close those fish swim near the beach. They want to get caught, I think, or I don't know. Why no, I guess they won't. But Oh, well. This is, of course, a place you can also get in the water, like you can see. Um, but there's a very big beach, the Seven Mile Beach, um, on the island. It's a free beach. It's or a 15 minute drive. 15, yeah. At least the parts of it are free. And uh, you can get there quite easily from the cruise terminal with a cab. Uh, they charge you $4. Um, per person. Per person. But if you don't have it, in small uh, bills? In small bills, well, uh, you have a hard time getting your money back. So they're not very fond of change, <laughs> we saw. Okay. Uh, they. It's all a game. So make sure you have small bills. They don't accept cards, at least not the taxis uh, from the cruise terminal. Let's walk up to the handcraft market. And then to the square. The square and the shops. mural. And then we say goodbye and go back to the ship. Yeah. Here you go look at the critical impression of Georgetown. Georgetown is right next to the cruise terminal. It's a lovely walk. It's and hot though. And as you saw there is no pier, so you have to tender from the ship to the shore. And tendering is a small boat. Yeah, you get to the large ship into a small boat. If you're likely to get seasick, then it's a bumpy ride. Oh, so nice. But if you get seasick easily, don't take a cruise. Yeah. Because last day there was some hard winds yeah, and yeah. they were rocking the boat. Here, the, the boat goes up and down. Right, thank you. We've done a couple of cruises in Northern Europe and it's less rocky than this cruise is. But you sleep like a baby when the boat's rocking. Well. I'm not sure all this is handcrafted, I think. A lot of it is also made in China, but... There is some handcrafting done. <laughs> Probably. <laughs> and as long as you believe it's handcrafted, it is. And Georgetown is the capital of the Grand Cayman Islands. And the Grand Cayman is you feel it's a rich island. You see it's a rich island, well maintained. There's a reason for that. Next to yes. tourism, they are specialized in uh, banking. banking and tax profits. So uh, every large accountancy firm has an office on the island. 
and they help large companies out to pay fewer tax. Yeah, you think it of it or you will, but oh well. I don't know how far it is. Yeah, I think it's hard because um, if you make profit, you have to pay your taxes to the government to maintain the system yeah. where you you operate and by uh, bringing the money over to an island like this. Uh, you don't support the system you where you gain your money from. You don't support it locally, but you support the place here. And we can't really think much of it because the Netherlands... is a tax paradise as well. Yep. Oh, I love this mural. And I'm not exactly sure how it works, but... Yeah, probably smart guys make the optimum of the rules there are. But yeah, and they, they shuffle around the profit, and if you make profit in a high-charged region, you send an invoice from the Cayman Islands to there and say, well, you have to pay me. Yeah. And then the profit is made on the Cayman, I, Grand Cayman Islands, and you have to pay less. Well, it's all legal. But yeah, yeah you can think about it what you want. Here you see the cruise port. We will walk up later on. And there are several excursions being offered from uh, the Cayman Islands. The most popular one is a Stingray excursion. And we highly recommend it. We did it seven yeah. years ago, seven or eight years ago. And it's basically a, a sand bank in the middle of the ocean. with a lot, a lot of ships around it. So it's a popular attraction. But the Stingrays, come there on their own terms, they're free to go and come, it's just in the middle of the ocean and they come because they get snacks, yeah. the people get some fish in their hands and they eat, eat it, it and, and you can So they them. come there because they know they will be fed, yeah. but it's lovely, you can cuddle them, you can pet them. And there's also the turtle farm experience and the dolphin experience. Mm -hmm. And I'm a less fan of that because, well, they're enclosed animals. Um, they do these excursions so, well, they can take care of them. So that, yeah, it's, it's, yeah it's but, but, but they c you can cuddle a sea turtle. Yeah. <coughs> and I know I did seven years ago, but I think I changed my mind on that. that it's okay you f you have visitors to show around what you do, but petting them not okay they're wild animals and they are supposed to go back in the wild so yeah, they don't have the get, they one? don't might get used to yeah. people around them it's, it's a wildlife conservation they make money to keep the wildlife yeah, it's, it's double-sided coin yeah but i won't do it again so that's at least our opinion of it and of course, also on this island, you see a lot of souvenir shops. Did we tell you how hot it is? No, not yet. It's, well, over 30 degrees. Celsius. It's, it's humid. It's hot. We already did this walk and it's so hot, my phone <laughs> shut down. So we're doing it again. It was overheated. <laughs> so actually, this is the second time we walked this tour, but now the other way around. <laughs> and here you see the House of Parliaments of the island. And of course there is hell, uh, which we made a video of. Um, maybe we'll clip it together with this video, or we, uh, make, yeah. or we do it separately, I don't know. But it's a town called Hell, and it has special rock formations. Um, I will show you. It's, it's a nice place, because you can say, I've been to Hell and back. Oh, look, little chicks. Oh, little chicks. Because be careful, Mama's protective. Yeah, of course she is. So you see a lot of wild chickens on the Caribbean islands. On the Caribbean islands. Yeah, so the islands. There's the library building, and this square has a lot of nice memorials and a working fountain. And of course, important fact: up there is Starbucks free Wi-Fi, good coffee.
and if you need money like I said it's a cash island so there are not a lot of places we've come by so far that accept the card and here's the ADM as well in this square the ADM is over there by the bus you see there let's enjoy this lovely statues and then we'll probably say goodbye because we need to buy a souvenir we didn't buy a Christmas ornament yet and we missed our Christmas ornament in Cartagena, Cartagena as well, as well so. so in front of the library after a short 10 minute walk and maybe we will edit how after this but or you can click it uh, above we well are. for here we say goodbye yes. to Grand Cayman hope we gave a good impression of the air uh, the island the island and I hope to see you in our next video bye bye bye